This is the NFL Playoffs Simplified. This weekend, we've got the divisional round coming up. So if you want a base level knowledge just to be able to discuss these games with the sports fans in your life, here you go. Let's get right to it. The first game is Saturday at 4.30 p.m. It is the Ravens versus the Texans. The Ravens were the one seed in the AFC, so they had a bye last week. They're playing the Texans, who won against the Browns last weekend. Their rookie quarterback, C.J. Stroud, was amazing. He threw for three touchdowns, which tied the rookie playoff record. He had already surpassed expectations coming into this year, and he just added to his amazing season with a win over the Browns. The Ravens and their quarterback, Lamar Jackson, are looking to win their first playoff game of these playoffs. Lamar has been amazing. He's about to win his second MVP this year, but he's only won one playoff game in his career. He's really struggled when Baltimore has gotten to the playoffs, so he's looking to get over that hump and finally put together a few playoff wins this year and maybe gets the Super Bowl. Then Saturday at 8.15 p.m., we have the 49ers versus the Packers. The 49ers are the NFC's one seed, so again, that means that they had a bye. Last week, the Packers were the seven seed, which is the lowest seed coming into these playoffs, the lowest seed in the NFC. That is, there's the NFC and the AFC. Um, the Packers were the seven seed, the last team in for the NFC, but they beat the number two seed Cowboys, and not just beat them, they demolished them. Jordan Love was, like C.J. Stroud, incredible also threw for three touchdowns just like cj stroud and the packers obliterated the cowboys becoming the first ever seven seed to beat a two seed so the packers have a lot of momentum but they have to play the 49ers and they haven't beaten the 49ers in the playoffs since 2002 they have faced them four times in the playoffs since then and they've lost all four so they do not have a good track record against the Niners, and the Niners are very good, so this will be a really tough one for the Packers. Then we move on to Sunday. We have the Lions versus the Buccaneers. This game is at 3 p.m. This is a really fun one because nobody really expected either of these two teams to be here, so both of them are quite happy to be here, and it's just it's going to be a fun game. Um, Detroit, they got their first playoff win in over 30 years. It's been such a long time for Lions fans, and they're really enjoying it. Um, they beat the Rams last week, and they are looking very good. So Lions fans have had a lot of hardship over the years, but this year they finally have a really good team. And they'll be playing the Buccaneers, led by Baker Mayfield, who had a really good game against the Eagles last weekend. Um, Tom Brady retired last year. He was with the Buccaneers. Um, and obviously, when you have Tom Brady, pretty tough guy to replace. But Baker Mayfield has been really, really good for the Buccaneers. Um, and he kind of fell off the past, the previous seasons. Um, but he's had a real resurgence this year and has the Bucs in the divisional round of the playoffs, which is pretty good. And saving the best game for last Sunday at 6.30 p.m., it's the Chiefs versus the Bills. This game is going to be incredible. At least it seems like it's going to be that way. Um, the Chiefs and the Bills are a modern rivalry. They have faced each other in two of the last four playoffs. Um, the Chiefs took down the Bills in both of those games, but they were both very entertaining games. And they're facing off for a third time. It's the Chiefs, Patrick Mahomes versus the Bills, Josh Allen. Um, Josh Allen has been amazing in his um, playoff career, but has not been able to get past the Chiefs. So that's an interesting storyline. This is also Patrick Mahomes' first road playoff game. He's played in Super Bowls where it's not in Kansas City, but that's a neutral site. This is his first playoff game where they are in an opponent's stadium filled with opponent's fans his first true road playoff game so we'll see how he handles that like i said these two quarterbacks are really the headline of this allen versus mahomes is going to be the main storyline those are the two that you need to pay attention to because they both make crazy plays on the field and they've faced each other before so there's history here and the bills are looking to finally be able to beat the chiefs in the playoffs so that's the divisional round 
Hopefully that gave you guys a little bit of insight and some extra knowledge so that you feel more prepared and just able to kind of know what's going on during the divisional round. Um, we are on the All Sports All The Time Instagram. The at is right there. Um, you can go follow us. We're doing a divisional round bingo, which is for all four of the games. Um, so go check that out on Instagram um, to see what the board is, see what we are thinking might happen during these games, um, and then follow along with us on our story. We'll be updating whenever we hit one of the squares. We did not get bingo with the Eagles, so we're going for bingo this week. So go follow us on Instagram. Thanks for watching, and let's enjoy the divisional round.